Alright, that was a good dungeon crawl. Took a while, we got a lot of levels under our belts. Carol and her Pete still need to level, but they're close. They should learn new moves as well, I hope. Or unless Repeat has to wait until 16, because I, I think he learns Thief at 16. I need him to learn Thief. Uh, okay. There's a, there's an event I don't want to miss now. Uh, okay. I'm not going to miss it. Good. We're going to head back to Ospio, and that's where it is. Warning! This game, Man, I'm going to pause right now. Weaker? This game is relentless when it comes to side quests. A lot of them are timed in that if you go too far in the main quest, you miss out on side quests, and some of them include the best weapons in the game. We're about to do the first part in a side quest. If you miss the first part, you can still continue the side quest, but you can never beat it. You have to do every part or else you can't beat that side quest. So if you miss this first little cutscene, which is very missable, you can never get the weapon. It's stupid as fuck. This is why I recommend a side quest guide for this game. There's a good side quest guide on GameFAQs that is very good for not spoiling stuff, and there's a very good side quest guide if you look up uh, Cooley Vesperia. Yeah, I beat you into next week. Next week? That's nice, but I can do so much. She's already learned everything off of her weapon. I mean, same with Yuri, but that makes sense. Let's have a look here. Uh, uh. She does not need strength. Oh yeah, she's got spirits. 20 plus extra TP. Very nice. Okay. Oh, there's a stomp. I always go for these stomps. says that. Iron grip. Iron grip. Nice. Alright. Let's head back into Ospio. So Flynn wasn't in there either. So who is this knight exactly? He's Yuri's friend. Hmm. Your friend? That must be a pain. Huh? Never mind. So what brings him to this town? He was looking for a mage to repair Halur's barrier blastia. Oh, that rookie. He came to see me too. Flynn did? Was he alright? Yeah, I guess. You guess? Well, since he's a knight, I'm sure he got some mage or another to help. Maybe he's already back in Halur. Oh no. Well? Do you trust me yet? I don't think Reed is the sort of person to steal. Vouch for her character all you like, but that doesn't prove her innocence. But... Don't bother trying to make him believe me. But I really didn't do it, you know. <laughs> well, I guess research seems to fit you better than robbery. Yuri isn't very good at expressing his feelings. What a weirdo. I'm gonna go let the city guards know about what happened. Go and wait for me in my lab. I don't think those stubborn guards will let us pass through the entrance. True. Then take this with you. Show this to the guard and they should let you through. Thanks. Got it? Don't leave town without my permission, or you'll be sorry. Passport. Now we can enter. We left the party. It's a good thing the core thief you're chasing turned out not to be Rita, right, Yuri? 
<laughs> well, how do you figure that? I couldn't care less who the core thief was. I would have loved it if it were Rita. <laughs> I'd be done by now. I wouldn't let her hear you say that. Well, at least we got a lead for catching the real criminal. I can't complain about that. Yeah. Let's go see Rita right now. If you're that worried about Flynn, would you rather leave now? It's just... I've got to say a proper goodbye to Rita. Then take it easy. What are you going to do after this, Yuri? I guess I'll go pay a visit to the guy behind all this core stealing. It sounds like Dedeki ended up going to the same place, too. In that case, we should make a beeline for Nor Harbor. Didn't he say Torum Harbor? Oh, right. You don't know. Don't know what? Nor and Torum are both ports of a city that extend across two different continents. On the Elikian side, where we are now, is the port of Kapua Nor. People call it Nor Harbor. Kapua Torum is the port on the other side, on the Tolbikian continent. It's usually just called Torum Harbor. So first we'll go to Nor Harbor. We'll have to pass by Emmied Hill on the way, but it's not that far west from here. I'll be going back to Halur. I still need to follow Flynn. Hmm, I don't know. Maybe I'll head back to Halur too. Huh? Why? How can you just say that? The thief's gonna get away! There's no reason to panic. According to our friend in the ruins, it sounds like his client's base there. Besides, if we're going west, that'll take us close to Halur. Yeah. Oh, man! But I... You gotta be somewhere? A sick girlfriend with an incurable disease or something? Man, if only she really was a frail girl like that. <sighs> I know I asked you to wait for me, but you sure made yourselves at home, didn't you? Oh, welcome back. What ended up happening to the thief? He's probably crying quietly to himself in his cell by now. Sorry for suspecting you. <laughs> what a heartfelt apology. I'll take it, though. It worked out pretty well for me, too. Rita? Well, thanks for the hospitality. What? Going so soon? We don't want to overstay our welcome. Plus, we're in a bit of a hurry. I'm so happy to have met you, Rita. I'm afraid we have to go now. I'll thank you properly later. Okay. Frail girlfriend. So tell me about this frail girlfriend of yours, Carol. What? The reason you want to go to Nor Harper is so you can see her, isn't it? H how do you know about her? I knew it! No! I mean, she's not even in Nor Harbor! Oh, it's not Nor Harbor? I, d I don't know what you're talking about! You might as well come clean, Carol. It's obvious Estelle's not gonna give up. You've got it all wrong! Carol! Ah. Uh, Alright. Uh. Yeah, yeah. Alright, we have to try to leave now. So we're gonna try to leave. If you're seeing us off, we'll say goodbye here. I'm going with you. You're doing what? Oh, so this is why you told us not to leave without saying goodbye, huh? Yeah. Is that it? Just yeah? Can you just leave like that? You're an important mage here, right? Hmm. I want to see Halur's barrier Blastia for myself. It's no good to the people if it's broken, right? Actually, the three of us fixed it together. Huh? What do you mean you fixed it? You're just amateurs. You know, we revived it. It was great! Let's just Estelle... say it was beginner's luck. Now I'm really worried. I'll have to go see if it's been done properly or not. Suit yourself. What? I've never had a real friend my own age before. I'm not so sure we're... This is going to be so much fun. Yeah. When we left the capital, it was just me, Repeat, and Estelle. Now Carol and Rita have joined us. I'm so happy to have more people to travel with. I'm not so sure about some people in our party, though. 
I'm not so sure about you, you little runt. Hey, now. Go easy on the young captain. Rita, we all have to work to get along, okay? Oh, yeah. Right. Now, now the game wants you to leave, right? Yeah, you remember that quest I mentioned where if you miss a single piece of it, you don't get the good reward at the end? Yeah, go back to her house. This is so goddamn missable. Game doesn't tell you to do this at all. Yeah, head back to her damn house. Also, I'm gonna be switching Carolyn to the combat now. Repeat's great, but... I'm switching Carolyn. You have to go over here, you have to go touch this. You really like Blastia, don't you? Hey, I told you not to touch Victoria with your grimy little hands. Victoria? Do you mean this Blastia? How come you like them so much? How come? Because they're fun. The way they work, the theory behind them? I don't know, I've never thought about it. Can you give reasons why you like the things you like? Well, there are definitely some things like for no, I like for no particular reason. Yes, the reasons I like them is because I like them. Exactly. That tiny cutscene right there is vital. If you don't get that, you can't beat one of the most important side quests for one of your side characters you get later in the game. That is for one of the side characters, one of their best weapons. <laughs> we haven't met the character yet, by the way. But if you don't have that stupid little cutscene right there, you can't finish it. It's stupid. Now, nah, let me double check to see I'm done here. Uh... All right. Good. Let's head to Allure. Oh. Have you been doing research in Ospio for a long time, Rita? Yeah, I guess about five years. Five years? Wow. Rita, how old are you anyway? I'm 15. W wow, y you're so grown up. I can't believe you were researching Blastia at 10. It's not a big deal. How old are you, Estelis? Oh, um, I just turned 18 this year. Time to grow up. Right. I'll do my best. Oh. All right. Let's head out. Ooh, hello. On the way, uh, do like three fights to get Carol and Rapide leveled. They'll level pretty quick. Because they need like two or three fights. You. This looks easy. Don't get careless. Ha, out of my way! Destroy the Destruction field! field. Yeah, I beat you into next week. I'll beat you into next week. Let's work together. This should be good enough XP to level one of them. Yep, there we go. Repeat. One more fight for Carol. I feel like an easy win. Don't get careless. Oh yeah, I should show. I have an ability now to push forward. Like that. See that? If you time that with enemy attack, you will take one damage. Yeah, if you do that advancing guard, the second an enemy doesn't attack, that attack will only do one damage. Isn't it hard to use a weapon that large, Carol? It's a little heavy, but I need to hold something large like this to make myself look bigger. That's just the right trick to hide your minuscule size. Ah, you want to look bigger to fool the enemies. Now that you mention it, small monsters often puff themselves up to appear more menacing. Right, it's just like... Huh? Are you saying I'm the same as a monster? Even so, changing your appearance doesn't change who you really are, Carol. Are you dangerous? Tell us right now if you are. It's okay. I'm an elite hunting blade. There's nothing to worry about. I hope that's not another one of your clever tricks. Ah. Also, we missed a freaking 
little event. I saw it, and then that one popped up. It just cock-blocked us out of a fucking skit. I don't know which one we missed. It's probably a funny one. Anyways, let's head into Halurx. Heck yeah. It's probably the repeat hitting level 14. Hey! The tree's already blooming? <laughs> I told you! We brought the tree back to life! Ah! Oh, you've returned, just as the knight said. Um, do you mean Flynn? Unfortunately, you just missed him. No way! Not again! He was quite surprised that the barrier had been fixed. Um, would you happen to know which way he went? N no, I I'm sorry. I, I don't know. However, he did entrust me with a letter. All right, let's check out this letter. <laughs> what? A wanted poster? Why? I guess I made a little too much mischief. That is a great wanted poster. That's a running joke in all the Tales games where a character gets wanted. Uh, they're always drawn horribly. <laughs> what kind of mischief gets you into this? It's my fault. Oh, come on. Only 5,000 gold? That's way too high for just breaking out of jail. You must have done something else. So, what does the letter say? I'm going to Nor Harbor. Catch up with me. Catch up with me, huh? Easy for him to say. He also writes that we should watch out for assassins. Well, he even knows we're being hunted. Sounds like this guy knows what he's doing. Looks like we have some dangerous people after us now. What are you gonna do? Well, um... I'm going to go to Nor Harbor. I could pass on a message for you if you want. But... I... Think about what you want to do. I'm gonna go make sure Rita isn't causing too much trouble. Alright, let's go talk to Rita. I have to... Flynn. There's Carol hanging out. Oh, there he is. How you doing, Carol? He doesn't understand us. That's fine. Da, da, da. I like stutter stepping. I can't believe it. I've never seen anything like this. The flowers are in full bloom, even though it's not the season for it. And the barrier's strong, too. Did Estelis really do this? What do you mean? Carol let it slip when we were leaving Ospio. You tried to change the subject, but it was too late. Guess I blew that one. We may just have nothing even remotely like she has. So you just decided to come with us to eliminate the competition? <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. I have a formula that I have to work out. A formula? What do you mean? It's nothing. <laughs> Forget about it. So what did you want? You came here for something, right? Well, that just took care of about half of it. So, what's the other half? You said that it's easy working with Blastia because they never betray you. Yeah, so? You and Estelle are both human. You're not Blastia. Oh, I get it. You're worried for her. Worried I might hurt her. Estelle's honest. Good. Unlike you or me. I'm just saying, don't do anything reckless. Come on, let's go back. Carol and Estelle are waiting for us. I finally found the clue I was looking for. I want to be all kinds of reckless. Hell yeah. Be as reckless as you want. Wow, I've never seen this many flowers on Halur's tree before. Huh? Doesn't it always get like that when the flowers are in season? In season or out, I've never seen all the buds blooming at once like this. Really? Well, guess we're lucky to get to see something so amazing. I'd say it's more abnormal than amazing. No, oh, it's pretty amazing. What are you talking about? Let's go see the others. 
That cow's moved. Anything new to synthesize or buy? Buy magic lenses. And I'm gonna buy poison to paralysis bottles because God knows we're gonna need them real soon. And more bread and more eggs. Now come back with us while you can. God, that has a terrible voice. I say, we've come to courteously escort you back to the capital. And then we can clamp Yuri in chains where he belongs. Why is Bokus's voice wrong? I've been waiting for you, Yuri Lowell! Don't you move a muscle! Jeez, this guy never lets up, does he? An old acquaintance you may be, but today I can overlook your transgressions no longer! Yuri isn't a bad person. I asked him to go with me. Yeah, Yuri, you ruffian! You're coercing Lady Astelis! No, this is what I really want. I'll go back to the castle. Just leave me be for a little longer. I cannot allow that. Return to the castle with us. I can't go back. Please understand this. We have no choice. We'll have to apprehend the criminal as well. Oh boy. Hey! Kiss your freedom goodbye, or it ends today! See that giant bar on the side of the screen? We're about to learn what that does. I say, prepare to face the Imperial Knight's ultimate fighting art, the Overlimit! The Overlimit doesn't belong to the Knights. Anyone can do it last time I checked. I say be quiet! Yuri, what's an Overlimit? It's a technique to increase your abilities while fighting. How do you do it again? You fool! How could you forget something like that? I say I shall jog your memory. Adakor's voice is the same, but Bokus is not. But after that, I say I shall give you a non-stop ticket on the train of death! First, attack! Curse you! Yeah! Attack! Attack! All right, you attack the enemy, and that raises your battle spirit. Blast! Your hits are not connecting at all! Ah. Ouch! I say that hurt! I cannot, I say, stand this any longer! Oh yeah, your battle spirit goes up if you're attacked, too. Gage fills up as you attack or when you receive an attack. All right, and then, if you release the battle spirit that you've stored up, Hit any D-pad in any direction. I'll blow you away! That's enough for today. Wow! Yuri, that's amazing! He uses basic arts and arts consecutively during an overlimit. We mustn't let his power charge up anymore! I've got you just where I want you. You know what that means? That's what this means. Oh. Here's what it means. Ow. Well, his overlimit just fucked mine over. Ah, fuck it and magic lends him. Damn it. Didn't even think of it. Okay, well, there's an achievement we're gonna miss out on now. I might get it at some point. I don't really care about achievements, though. Nice work, men. I'm sorry. I can't go back. These are the threads that weave our future. Hey. Cross counter and all that shit. Ugh. What a shame. Uh. Rita! She says she's not going back, so get lost! Yuri! It's them again! Damn it! I knew they were still after us. What is it this time? W what do you mean? 
I'll explain later. Carol, which way is Nor Harbor? Uh, uh, it's west, west! You go over a meat hill, and Capua Nor is right there. All right, let's go now then. But I can't. Ah, uh, make a decision. Which do you really want to do? Keep traveling with us or go home? I'm going to keep traveling. A wise choice, and one that those knights surely wouldn't be able to agree with. Imperial Knight Point One. With this sword, I shall protect the people, wasn't it? Indeed! Come on, boys! Let's show them what the Imperial Knights are made of! I'm sorry. Your page was another battle book. That's about over limits. Da -da 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 -da. Yes, now we have overlimit level one. Any in the party can use it, and when you activate overlimit, you can spam abilities forever. Infinite combo of any type of attack. Great. What are you looking at? <laughs> hey, dog, you keep away. Huh? Rita, are you afraid of dogs? Not at all. Mind your own business. Oh, no. Hey, Rita, I wanted to ask you about this. Oh, repeat. Repeat sure knows who he likes and who he doesn't. Yep. <laughs> okay, uh, I gotta remember where to go now. Uh, that's Dayton Hold. I wanna head towards Dayton Hold for a second. See if we can spot it or not. Ah, oh, you bastard. Our formation's all over the place. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. This is all awesome. very easy. As you're rich. Put out your hand. I want to see if I can spot an enemy. It's not here. It'll probably appear later. Okay. We're at the part of the game where it's about to get hard. The next boss is tough as shit. Just a warning. Next boss is not to be fucked with. I am very serious when I say that. Here are, here's a meat hill. To make sure I am not missing anything. Nope. Okay. So this is Emmett Hill? Yeah, but... That's weird. The barrier's gone. You mean there was a barrier here? There was when I came before. Sort of a waste to have a barrier in a place with no people, if you ask me. Are you sure you aren't mistaken? I'm pretty familiar with the barrier locations, but here... You just haven't heard about this one. Nan told me it was only put here recently. Who is Nan, Carol? Huh? Uh, she's... Uh, you know, she's just a friend from my guild. I'm gonna go see if I can find anything out. I think I'll have a look myself. All right, never mind us, guys. I'm not gonna go look for them if they get lost. Shall we, Yuri? Ah. Hey, hey, no outsiders allowed! Let me through. I'm Rita Mordio of the Imperial Blastia Research Laboratory. Oh, you're a mage from Ospio. Excuse me. Oh, but you can't just do as you please. Let me go and ask the... <laughs> I could use some of her attitude. I think you have plenty already. Hey, listen to this! It was like BAM! A spear went thunk, the Blastio went bang, and he flew up into the sky like whoosh! Who did what? How? Huh? 
Someone riding a flying dragon threw a giant spear at the Blastia and then just flew off! A human riding a dragon? No way. I've never heard of anything like that before. That's what I thought too, but a bunch of people here saw it happen. They say it was a dragon rider. A dragon rider? <laughs> well, the world's just full of surprises. Hey! What do you think you're doing? Let me go! There she goes again. Something is definitely strange with this Blastia formula. There's nothing strange at all. Perhaps you are... Just who do you think I am? I'm well aware of who you are. The famed genius mage, correct? But surely there are some formulas that even you aren't familiar with. You can't use a weird formula like this. Think of the poor Blastia. Hey, stop gawking and help us catch her. Fire! Hey! Fire! What's with that kid? A fire? I don't hear anything or smell anything. Hey, you little liar. Crap, they caught on that fast? Yeah, that was a terrible lie. Hey, you were with that kid. Wait a minute. You, there's a warrant for your... Oh, it's now or never. Fucking nice. Ugh, you little. Hey, wait. I'm sorry. Stop, kid. Hey, stop goofing off and help catch that kid. Damn. Okay, I left the party. Whew, looks like we lost him. <sighs> Rita, you should really think more before you act. <sighs> that barrier blessed you was just so strange. I couldn't help myself. Strange? Something fishy about it? I have a feeling that may be an understatement. Well, our hands are already full as it is. So could you please keep us out of it? It doesn't concern you regardless. Yuri Lowell, where have you run off to now? Hey, Mr. Famous, sounds like you've got a fan out there. Again, well, that gives a new meaning to the word workaholic. Lady Esteles, I say, do come out of hiding. You guys have a lot of problems. Just who are you anyway? Um, well, I'm... Yuri! Come out! Come out wherever you are! You can talk about that later. Whoa! Wait! Wait! It's me! Ah! Carol! Don't frighten us like that! Anyway, let's get our butts to Nor Harbor before things get any more complicated. Which way were we supposed to go again? Let's see. As the crow flies... Isn't this a beast trail? <laughs> can we really go through here? We'll go as far as we can at least. I don't want to get captured again. We'll need to be on the lookout for monsters then. Eh, what are one or two monsters to the brave Captain Carol? Yeah, that's right. Though if the barrier were up, we wouldn't have to worry about monsters at all. Oh, I can't stand it. Why does some idiot have to go around breaking Blastia and making our lives difficult? Carol doesn't party again. All right. Who's Nan? Hey, Estelle. I noticed you keep looking in my direction. What's up? You don't mind if I ask? All right. Well, then, here goes. This Nan. Are you in love with her? <coughs> <coughs> Nan is a girl's name, right? Is she the girl you wanted to show Halur's flowers to? Ah! No! No, no! You got it all wrong! I do? Man, she'd be so angry if she heard you say that. Carol, good luck with her. I'm rooting for you. Uh, yeah. Well, thanks. That's encouraging. Great. All right, let's make sure I don't miss anything. Uh, yeah. Mead Hill. Okay. New enemies as well. Guess we can do this. 
I'm Beetle. Oh, nice! You just learned Nice Aid Smash. It's a great attack. He smashes. I believe it hurts enemies and heals allies. Does it actually hurt enemies? No, it just heals allies. How many times do you use that now? 176. Nice. Oh my god, camera. Oh, she's firing two fireballs now. So, oh, she needs 60 uses for two fireballs. Okay. So yeah, now she fires two fireballs with every cast. Ah, oh, fuck, which way to go? Ah, this way. Guess we can do this. Your weird jumpy thing, seaside -y. Weak to fire, huh? Oh. Come here. Yeah, I beat you into next week. Next week? I didn't know flowers like this grew in the mountains. Rita, don't touch it. Inhaling Billy Bolly Leaf Pollen can lead to vertigo and strong feelings of exhaustion. Hmm. Hey, what are you? Whoops, sorry. Carol, are you okay? You're interested in healing arts? Nah. It's no use. Healing arts don't work on this. We'll just have to wait until he recovers naturally. How long will that take? Carol, be strong. Ugh, Rita, you're terrible. I said I was sorry. If you're all right, then let's go. Let's be careful to stay away from the Billy Bolly Lee from now on, okay? That's an important hit for later. Man, some people have some weird hobbies. I mean, who goes around destroying Blastia? I wouldn't really call that a hobby. If we ever come across whoever's doing this, I'll destroy him! But what if he has some reason for what he's doing? They can have any reason they want. Destroying Blastia is unforgivable, period. Oh, my, my neck! My neck! Oh! Oh! Help me, Yuri! Eh, that'd take effort. Just play nice with each other, kids. Estelle! Um, do your best, Carol. Jesus. Let's work together! Is Carol all right? <laughs> You did it, Rita. Yeah, I feel power running. Yeah, level up. Level 15. Does that mean I get a new move yet? Francesca. New weapon, Magic Guard, Item Pro. Nice. Oh, she's done with the rapier. She can start the stiletto now. Now, this axe great, but this axe has two less damage with a bunch of skills on it, so I'm putting that back on. Ah, oh, fuck. 
Okay, uh... This... I want step away critical guard. There we go. I love critical guard. Can't live without it. There it is! So we just learned an arcane art, which is a combination of Azure Edge and Wolf Strike. Awesome! I am putting that instead of Azure Wolf Strike. Now, why is that important? I'll show you in the next battle. There's the difference between basic art and arcane art. Red eyes, knights. Why can't we just have a nice, fun, relaxing trip? You're one to complain, Yuri. Yeah, weren't those knights calling your name? But you're the one who was fighting with the mages, Rita. Please, everyone, we're okay, aren't we? I actually think it's kind of fun. If you think being chased is fun, you're gonna love the rest of this trip. Yeah, you may have written off what just happened, but we're still fugitives. Hey. Yeah, once we get into the fight, I'll show you what I can do now. Quite nice. It's very important to the combo system of this game. All right, let me show it off. Don't get sloppy. Step one. I'll blow you away. I didn't want to overlimit. There we go. Leave it to uh, defend. Let's try this. All right. Holy Let me use my overlimit because I wasted it. Alright. Stop attacking. Strength, dwell in this blade. Thank you. Okay, so let me show you what I can do. I can do a three hit combo. Did you see that? I just did a three hit combo, basic art, and then an arcane art. You can combo any of these moves into one of these. Any of these basics can combo into an arcane. It's pretty fucking good. Also, uh, you can put other people's spells on your list. If you didn't know, so I could put uh, Starstroke on here. If I ever hit, eh, we cast Starstroke. That body blastia of yours. It's pretty, huh? That's not what I was gonna say. But yeah, I'm gonna remove that little shortcut because I I don't want her casting Starstroke randomly when I'm trying to fight. <laughs> Nice. How are people doing for their learning? Everyone's done, I think. Oh man, I love Forks in the Road. This is the way for the uh, dead end. Dead end with loot. Uh, I'm gonna do it. Okay, oh, yeah, axes attack much slower for Yuri than uh, swords. I usually have more damage. Usually. Put out your hand. Oh, I Hey, she leveled. Nice. That was a pretty big commotion over breaking a single barrier, Blastia. I don't know. It seemed like the commotion Rita caused was even bigger. Stop bringing up trivial details. Of course people would be upset. It was a barrier, Blastia. Blastia are intertwined with almost every aspect of people's daily lives. Good point. Things got really crazy back in the lower quarter oh, when the last year broke. I hope they can fix it soon. Yeah, I mean, that's what we're going through all this for. Life bottles. Oh, this is actually the way to go, I think, because that's the Don't save point. Sloppy. I gotta backtrack then. How's my Azure Edge use? Oh, good boy. Easy. Hmm. Good job, Rita. 15, 15, 15, 14, 14. Okay. Repeat and Carol need to catch up. Don't get sloppy. 
Hey, she let him pierce bluster. Good attack. Hit him. Put out your hand. Like this. There we are. Don't get sloppy. Go. What do we got? Scarf. Not what she already has. Oh no, that's new. Backstep. Hey. Taking backstep. Very good. Everyone needs to learn how to backstep. Don't get sloppy. I like using Overlimit uh, every now and then just to do basic combos like this to just get free TP. I got like 30 back. And I got the third of the bar back, so. There we go. Yeah, I like using Overlimit every now and then just to do basic attacks just to get uh, TP back. Get like 30 or 40 in a single use. Nice. This is a very important save point. It's very important. Just go away. Ow. Rude. Wonderful. Get up. There's no way you could win. All right, let's see. This is the dangerous save point. I think it's up ahead. Yeah, it is. We are right next to a boss battle, and it's one of the toughest boss battles in the first half of the game. Because you're not ready for this boss. If you're if you're playing the game on easy, you're probably ready. If you're playing on normal or hard, you're not ready. I'm not ready. I need to grind. Next week. Next week? Oh my god. Magic guard. Oh. Join that. Let me have a look at my list here. Da -da 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 -da. All right, yeah. We have the start of a side quest we need to go do, which is back in Halur. So this is the perfect time to save and go ahead and backtrack. We can head back to Halur. Uh, on the way, we'll probably fight a bunch of stuff, gain levels. Once everyone's level 16, we'll be ready for the next boss. So this is a good time to backtrack. You. Yet, yet. No, come on. Can we go this way like that? Yeah, we can. Just don't head too close to the blast yet, and it's fine. Alright. Let's head back to Halur. 
And because these boys need some levels, let's put them in the main party. Uh, Estelle needs slightly more XP than Rita, so just put her in there. What moves to Carolyn repeat? Okay. Yeah, Estelle learns a lot of moves because she's a supporty healer kind of character, so she learns moves all the damn time. Double fight. Piece of cake. Don't get cocky. Two hundred five times. The move is not slightly faster. Hey, I don't know if you've noticed. We're just getting into recipe. I skipped past it pretty quickly, but cooking. We learned rice ball. Okay. I'm gonna change it back to the sandwich because he needs to master it. Here we are. Uh, now who do I need to talk to again? We need to talk to old man by the tree and the couple standing near the entrance. Okay. If you head for the sea, uh, if you head for the sea from here, you can you can't help running into Emid Hill. Say there is the remains of some monster in the ground about halfway up. The story goes that this monster was as long as the trunk of the tree allure. Big, right? Not long ago, I caught sight of a gallant man on my way home from the port city. He was tall and slender with silver hair, but he was headed into the mountains, and nobody's seen him since. He was far too handsome to be a hermit. I wonder who, could, who he could have been. Tall, slender man with white hair? Oh, where have we ever seen that before? Anyways, over here. Lenses. Gear. Oh, shit. Okay. Water gel. A random effect, by the way. Alright, we got some new stuff. Uh, great Axe plus one. Done. Chain plus one. Done. Oka plus one. Done. One defense for that. No thanks. 36. I would use up all the bear skin I have. Where did I get this? Oh, from the egg bear. Sure, I guess. Hey, we can make the special flag. Boom. Yes, the special flag allows me to. Oh, change leader. I can run as Carol. What does he do? Points. And he he gets confused. He's pointing. Okay, weird. Stell. Uh, she prays. Uh, what was that other thing? Okay, just point up, I guess. Rita, what should do? Point, angry. Alright, what else does she do? Uh. Just, just ready, huh? Da -na 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 -na. Why? I don't know. Great. You can change part later and stuff. I'm gonna go back to you, right? But yeah, that's important. Uh, you need that later. Oh, I almost forgot. Second side quest. Gotta go up to the tree. 
Yeah, you need that for a side quest way later in the game. Also, sometimes it's fun to run around to someone else. For a little bit. Hello! Red, so very red. This year is especially bad. What's the matter, Mayor? Oh, you're back. What about something being red? Oh, just that this year's flowers are an especially deep shade of red, so I was thinking that the curse of the caged emperor's bride must be particularly strong this year. But I'm just joking, of course. Who's this caged emperor's bride supposed to be? About 300 years ago, the emperor at this time, Brimstone the Fourth, planted a tree on the perimeter of Valera's barrier. He lived all of his later years shut inside his castle, so people took to calling him the caged emperor. It's always so educational to have you around, Estelle. What does the Caged Emperor's Bride have to do with this tree? Legend has it that the Caged Emperor has murdered his fiancée and buried her corpse beneath the root of this tree. The tree gets its red color from the murdered bride's blood, which, it, which its roots absorb. Well, what the hell? It's really nothing more than a legend. Of course, there's no way a tree could keep sucking up someone's blood for centuries anyways. Yes, but I'm worried that this macabre tale will spread and drive potential visitors away from our town. Then don't you think it's a bad idea telling it to travelers like us? I, uh, oops, uh, forget I, forget all about that story I just told you, could you? How are we supposed to forget something like that? You don't forget it, the Cage Emperor's Bride will hold a grudge against you. Cut it out. Here you go again, you're just reinforcing the legend. Oops. There's no way that story's true. There we go. That's important. Later. Oh boy. Let's go towards the next boss. So, the reason why you should not fight the next boss on hard is because he has 66,000 HP, which is a lot. So, my tip for the next boss. Fight him on like normal or easy. Like seriously, he's a bitch. Also his uh, special event slightly difficult, I guess. It's, it's eh. I wish I could turn the camera faster. There's not an option to change the camera speed, sadly. It's it's always the same. Man, could you be any weaker? Let me at him! As you <laughs> and there goes repeat leveling up. I want to be either level 15 or 16. The best place to level would be inside of a mead hill because hey, enemies there you are, any weaker? you know, closer to our level. Thank you, Rapid. You know, after the next battle, I'm gonna have repeat cook something. Oh man. Alright, alright. That was awesome! Hey, I learned some. These are the threads. Hey, skills. Alright. I'm gonna repeat cook something. You cook dog food. No one's gonna have skip for that? Okay, fine. Uh, Nice, we're learning that stuff. He's still learning the Tamagane, and then we need to go back to Oka plus one for the uh, recover. He needs to learn to start using Great Axe again. That thing is pretty good now. Plus got Defending Guard plus. Great. She's done with that weapon, so she can go back to the rapier. Lowers her magic, though. She, she could go with, like, Stiletto, and she'd be pretty damn good, or the mace, and she'd do have really good magic. But you know what? Stick with the rapier for now. She's still learning that. Okay. Back to Emid Hill we go.
I'm gonna try to t to get close to the blast. Yeah, I don't think. Yeah, it's just gonna take no. Thought so. We have to approach it, but we can't do it yet. Do it later. Leave it to me. The weird sounds the repeat makes. This looks easy. Warm me up. I like how they're like, this looks easy. This is the hardest time you run into. We don't need to use done. poison balls. She has recover. She can just cure the poison with a spell. Sorry if I hurt you. He's dead. You didn't think I was that strong, did you? We're getting about a hundred XP per fight. That means we need twelve fights to get them up. Okay. That's a couple of battles, but uh, I'm gonna do that's it. fine. Oh, I'll rip my fucking TP though. We're getting about 80 XP per fight, so yeah, like 17, 18 fights. Sorry, Depends on the amount of enemies in the fight, I guess. Yeah, I beat you into next week. Next week? And she, uh, Rita learned her backstep. That means she's done with the scarf, so go back to the chain, because now it's Vade on it. Sixteen. Uh, Stell's gonna be next, then Rita, then Ethan, Carol. This looks easy. Don't get careless. Man, I was just getting warmed up. Come here. Come on. Hard to aim. There we go. We got a head start. All right, let's go. Man, I was just getting warmed up. Very good. The bird at. Let's get this over with. Yeah, I be. 
good. Alright, so they're about nine or ten fights from leveling. Do we save and I believe you can go and load your save. And yeah, all the enemies back. I won't lose! It'll be a hundred years before you can be. Oh, there we go, Estelle leveled up. So close. Put Reed in the party now. Ultimate killing power. Also, I for some reason switched to her. You want revenge? Bring it! Hey, Alonso! Hey, Magic Guard. Good. Rita levels up next fight. Guess we can do this. Now, I want the ability to change character in combat, but I don't have that yet. Eventually, we got an item that you can just change your character mid fight. It's great. I got a little worked up. I feel this power inside. I feel this power. Yeah, keep using that. Uh, you keep using that. You're almost done. You're gonna switch to the Oko once you're done. More fights. I won't lose. I also want to make sure to have over limit before we go into the next boss. All right, so she just got a new attack. It's a melee attack. Guess what? Go away. Oh, and she learned a spell as well. So she learned a melee attack and a spell. Looks like a water spell. Splash. Yeah, intermediate spell. Very, very nice. Intermediate spells take much longer to cast and are much more powerful. And we're gonna do the same thing again. And load or save, yes. Load the save we just made. Just go away! This? No, this is Three more fights should be good. Oh, man. Yeah, sorry if you don't want to see grinding. There's going to be some grinding in the future. If I ever have to do, like, longer than an hour, I'm going to be, uh... I'm gonna be doing it, but for the YouTube version of this, it will be cut out. Oh yeah, we took a lot of damage there. Carol, nice aid smash, please. Thank you. One first aid. Thank you. Yeah, for a uh, nice aid smash will heal your entire party. For a lot less, though. I'm gonna do it! That was easy. I just keep it. That's nice. And Rita just learned evade. 
Very nice. I'm gonna give her back the scarf because that's more magic attack and that's what matters on Rita. Magic attack because she's a mage. Who'd have thought? Yeah, Alright, this is the last time we have to fight and then it's the last time. And my over limit is ready. Good. Very nice. He leveled up. And he maxed his things. Put on the Oka. Everyone's maxed their stuff except him. Great. Alright. Let's set up our actual team for this fight. I want Estelle. I want Rita. And I want Carol. We're gonna fucking save. I am gonna restore everyone to mostly full. There we go. Here comes some shit. Oh boy. What's that? That's one of the monsters that attacked Halur! A survivor, huh? If we leave it here, it'll surely go back and try to attack Halur again. But Halur has the barrier protecting it now. Even so, how are the people of Halur supposed to sleep at night when beasts like this crawling around just outside the barrier? That's Gattuso! Gattuso is really fucking powerful! Step one, Gattuso Cubs. Oh boy. Step one is to kill the Gertuso Cubs. Oh, he's already on the way. Great. Uh. Here's Gertuso. What is 26k health? Okay. I'm gonna run over to one of these plants. Strategy, uh, defend. Come to me. Come to me. Please. Come to me. Oh my god. Come to me. No, 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 no. Fuck. Ugh. The secret challenge is so annoying to do. It has to do with a plant. And they were never hurt. Yeah, yeah, load the save. Luckily, in the PS3 version, which is... Fuck off. Don't get Let me show you how to run away from combat. Fuck off. In the PS3 version of this game, which is what this is based off of, you can skip cutscenes. Which you couldn't in the Xbox version. So. Yay! We have to magic lens again. Okay. 
a little bit different strategy this time. Murder the kids. One's dead. Now everyone go to defend. Why am I walking? I'm walking. Come for me. Come for me. Go for me. Go for me. Go for me! There are other people in the party! I exist! Yes! Didn't count! Fuck! This is such an annoying... Fucking thing. Gatuso, please. Yeah, sure. Gatuso, please. I'm gonna have to do this on easy. I love it when he doesn't even fucking help. Gatuso! There are other people in this fight! Well, this is kind of what I want. It's just, uh, not enough. Well, we're gonna have to set it to easy just to get the secret achievement. Fucking hell. God, I hate this fight. And they were never. Ugh. Like, I can beat it on normal. A regular fight? By getting the secret achievement as well? No. We gotta do something fucking easy. Fuck off! Don't get sloppy. I don't have time for you! Yo. Ugh! I'm gonna kill one of you. Fuck off. I don't have time for you. We got a boss to kill. Well, we got a boss to secret achievement. Let me have a look. Yeah, knock him down while he's stunned by Billy Bally. <sighs> so there's a difference between this uneasy. First of all, a lot less health, and second of all... Never mind. He's not supposed to start fighting you until his things are dead. I guess they changed it. Jesus, could do so. Well, he has a lot less health. I'm okay. I'm fine. I'll blow you away. As your wolf strike. Destroy it. I'm okay. Take this. Take this. As your wolf. Take it. Damn it. Fucking as your wolf. Knock him down. All right. Fucking. Let me get up. Not count. Please heal me. Please heal. Please heal. Oh my God. See, if these were not in the corners of the map and it's in the middle, it'd be a lot easier. Okay.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck. Fucking come at me, please. Actually, when he's in overlimit, I don't think I can knock him down. Hey, we did it. Great. All right, kill him. Get up. Hey, I just got up. Hey, yeah, you fuck off. Get up. I did get a lot of damage. Ow. 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 Oh, of course I have to stun me when he knocked me back. Just let me move. I'm just gonna fucking run. Please heal me. Don't heal me. Kill him. Thank you. Commission three. Fuck that shit. God, that's annoying. Yeah, and I can beat him on normal. I can beat him on hard. It just takes a lot of grinding, but doing the secret achievement at the same time ain't fucking happening. Attack ring. What the heck? It, it hardly put up a fight. Stop lying, Carol. But there could be a dozen more just around the corner. No worries. Seriously. Well, let's just hope there aren't too many more where it came from. Shut up, Carol. I'm going back and saving, and I'm changing it back to normal. God, I hate lowering the difficulty for shit like that. But that fucking fight is just ridiculously overtuned. It always has been. It's one of those, like, hey, the game's gonna fuck you at this point? I hope you like it. <laughs> Thievery, hey! Good. He has an attack now, called Thievery. Every now and then he'll use it, and it's got a 15% chance to steal, I believe. Your legs are shaking. You're kidding. Yeah, I feel. I think it's something like a 15% chance to steal something, and it'll steal, I believe, a rare item from the enemy, a rare drop. Okay, we got a very nice item. It is an attack ring. 10% more damage during battle. Yes, please. Oh yeah, I gotta make sure we don't miss anything now. Uh, 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 uh. Good. All right. Everyone wants to use orange shells now. We don't have that many orange shells. Yeah, I beat you into next week. Next week? Oh, has Yuri mastered the sandwich yet? He has. Good. Okay. Uh, shortcuts. I need to set up. Let me look at the cooking guide. Uh, 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 uh. Da, da, da.
Good. All right. Uh, we need. Alright, Yuri needs to start cooking another uh, thing now. It's going to be Yuri cooking rice balls. We don't have what we need to make them yet. But hey, once we do, the great! It's beautiful. This is. Look, Yuri. It's the ocean. I can see that. The wind feels great. I've seen pictures in books before, but I've never seen it up close like this. Well, people don't usually travel outside the barriers. If we keep going, we can see all sorts of things, like the jungle or the city of waterfalls. There are so many more things we could learn. If only our journey would continue. I guess it's true. I really was living in a small world. That's a rare moment of sincerity coming from you. It's your first time seeing it too, right? Well, yes, but... Aw, you must have had such a lonely life, tied to your research like that. Having you pity me makes me want to jump off this cliff. This water has traversed the world's oceans and has seen all there is to see. The ocean binds the lands of our world together. Here she goes again. It's really just one big puddle, you know. Whatever. You were pretty moved back there, too. Huh? <laughs> so this is the world as he sees it. Yuri? Flynn must have stood on this spot earlier and looked out at this same scene. That's true. His duties do take him to many different places. Always telling me to catch up with him. Easy for him to say. Nor Harbor is just around the corner from Emmett Hill. We'll catch up to him in no time. That's not what I was talking about. Huh? What do you mean? All right, let's get moving before LeBlanc and friends show up again. Just follow the ocean road to the west after leaving here to get to Nor Harbor. We can't miss it. We'll have plenty more chances to see the ocean. Your journey will continue for as long as you want. <sighs> it's all up to you. You've made it this far, haven't you? That's true. Last one down's a rotten egg! You're the rotten egg. Watch out. Oh! Idiot. Oh, we almost lost him. Damn it. So close. Now let's make sure I don't fuck anything up. There. Shell and grave. What's this supposed to be? Is it a grave? Grave in a place like this? Actually, this is just the type of place I'd expect to see one. What do you mean? You know, like the grave of someone who plotted against the Empire and failed. If you want to bury somebody and keep it quiet, you want a place like this with no one around. Oh, wonder if that's what I've got in store for me. Don't say such things, that isn't funny. I wasn't exactly kidding. It's just a fact of life that some folks from the lower quarters never get a funeral or proper burial. What happens to them then? They get cremated and have their ashes scattered over a river or a field usually. Are you telling the truth? How did we get started talking about this anyway? Because we're trying to figure out what a lonely grave is doing in a place like this. Yeah, so just who does it belong to? Yeah, it doesn't say. Alright, good. We're about 80% done through Mead Hill. Little area down here, though, with some loot and stuff. God, Gatusa's go a bitch. Ow. Too shabby, huh? 
Oh yeah, I can't cook that yet. Forgot. I don't have the ingredients just yet. There we are. Here's a little side area. With but if you didn't scan them earlier, here's some uh, here's some Gattuso boys. Seventeen. I would like her to heal me. Thank you. Is there nothing down that little corner? Okay. Got it. That's a hard target to hit. I'm gonna make you work. Destruction. You didn't think I was that strong, did you? Very nice. All right, uh, all right, let's get repeat back in the party for a bit. Double fight. All right, let me show you the true power. Oh, no, that's right. I can't switch characters mid combat yet. Never mind. I'm going to show you the true power, which is Rita on Overlord. Hey, resist! Thank you. Damn it. Alright, who's next? Resound to cry a victory. Armored helmet. Oh yeah, I forgot to equip my new armor I got earlier. Probably would have helped. There's a new helmet. God damn good. Come on, my friend. Here we go. Might as well get Let's the upper advantage with. here. There we go. Let's see what we get. Holy bottle and we get some gold. Nice. At 14k, once we get to the next town, we'll be able to stock up on a lot of new shit. I think we've learnt everything. Yeah, he's still learning of the Oka, but he's pretty much about to be done. Son of a bitch. Got him. It'll be a hundred years before you can beat me. Hey, there we go. I finished the Oka. Let's switch his weapon. The Tomagane. What's this? Oh, that's a camping set. With this, you can set up camp and sleep without having to go to an inn. Oh, that's nice. Now you can go off and play Nature Boy whenever we sleep at an inn. And we'll sleep funny, too. W what are you talking about? Camping sets are single-use only. 
Rita, don't be so mean. Hmm. Huh. That sounds really useful, Carol. Yeah, they're essential when you're on the road. In addition to camping sets, you could also sleep on mats. But camping sets are really the best thing to use. You can't get a better night's sleep with anything else. What wonderful timing. All of you look so exhausted from climbing. You look pretty pooped yourself. Yeah, we've got a ways to go before we get to town, too. Maybe we should set up camp here. All right, I'll get everything set up. Oh, once you've camped somewhere, you won't be able to camp around there for a while afterwards. Why's that? After camping at a certain site, the basic barrier that's included in the camping set will stop being effective for a while, so long as you're near that site. Basic barrier? What's that? There's no Blastia like that. It's not a Blastia, actually. It's just something that gives off a smell that monsters find unpleasant. That's why they call it a barrier. It can keep the monsters at bay for a night. But after enough time passes, the monsters get used to the smell, and it won't keep you safe anymore. Hmm, that makes sense. Well then, we'll leave the setup to you, Carol. All right, let's set up a camp a little bit further. Hey, we got a tent. Heals a whole bunch. Yeah. Great, uh, can I do the thing I want to do now? Ah, yeah, that's right. We have to leave and come back. <laughs> because side quests. So go ahead and go out in the overworld and go right back. Ah. Missable stupid shit like this. I love it. Not really. You know, I think it'd be better if we turned back. How come? This is where that broken blast he is. I know that. Well, let's go back. If the knights find us, we'll get in trouble. I just want to have a look at that blast here. I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna look. I get caught. Not that much of a klutz. Rita. You know. Katrin. Katrin? She named that blast here, didn't she? All set. Yeah. There's nothing that I can do for her. It's just too cruel. I mean, I understand a blast of valuable items, but... It's not about how valuable they are. Countless people have given their lives to make human civilization what it is. And blasts have been living together with mankind all that time. They're more than just a simple tool that we use. Well, it's certainly clear that blasts are very important to Rita. Yeah. We're all finished here. We should be on our way. Okay. There we go. That's important for later. In order to get one of the best weapons in the game for one of our uh, other characters. Which will be great. Now, I don't remember. Can I save at just any point, or do I require a save? I can just save at any point. Good. Because I need to check something. What is the time? Okay, I got plenty of time. Good. Plenty of time. Ooh, new enemies. Oh, oh man. man. All right, all right. A whole bunch of new enemies. Thieves. <laughs> and sorcery. Sorcerer is pretty easy to kill. Oh yeah, I can't check their drops until I'm in the monster book. I got a little worked up. Oh, Grimoire pages. I do need those for a thing. I remember that. I need that for an item. Let's get this over with. Floating Fillow. Think! Think before you use your arts! Guess I overdid it. Shut up. I'll spam all I want. Alright. They know each 
each other way too well. Repeat leveled? What level is repeat now? 17. Very good. All right. Can we have a double battle? Yeah. The most I've had in this game is a quad battle, I think. Green Roper. All right. Where the mage is at? As we don't. Right, he's meleeing because she's low on TP. Get up. Read it, don't push me. I got a little worked up. Very nice. Already fought one of you. Fought, yeah. Another one, we fought one of you. Yeah. Okay, I think we followed new enemies. He's going to town. Well, yeah, let's make sure. All right, I'm gonna pause that. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, good. Man, the weather sure changed in a hurry. Let's find an inn before we get soaked. Estelle, what is it? Oh, I... I just thought a harbor town would be more lively than this yeah this isn't exactly how i imagine it either but it feels like the kind of place that core thief you're looking for would hang out dedeki was headed for torum harbor i'm sure the two are pretty similar no way it's only nor harbor that's scummy like this what do you mean nor harbor is it's all I because of the you empire what happened to that little brat if you didn't have our money please sir not that Please give me back my son. With this awful weather the last few months, we haven't been able to launch the boats. Surely you realize, sir, we can't hope to pay our taxes like this. You'd better hurry up and capture that Ribgaro beast then, shouldn't you? That's right. If you sell his horn, you'll never have to worry about taxes again. How many times do we have to tell you? Savages. Is that the sort of scum you were talking about, Carol? Yeah, the Empire's influence is really strong here. I heard things got even worse with the new Magistrate. He's some Imperial big shot who does whatever he wants. Which means there's no one to complain to if his henchmen act like that. <sighs> but how can that be? That's enough! You're hurt! You might even get yourself killed this time. But it's our son. If I don't go... Ah, what are you trying to do? Oh, sorry about that. I didn't see you there. Yuri! My apologies, sir. Let me take care of that. But I... I can't afford this treatment. Don't you have something else to say? Huh? Jeez, you guys been robbed of your manners along with your money? Uh, I'm sorry. Thank you most kindly. Hmm?
Why is Carol just smiling? Huh? Yuri? Part with everyone. Oh boy. I don't like this encounter. Can I talk to you first? Good. Uh. Okay, there'll be some new stuff to buy. Nothing for me though. Synthesis. Very nice. That'll be good for Rita. Even though she's going to be in battle most of the time. Hey, we can make a customization item. I'm doing it. What that means is if we want to, we could put classes on them. It's... I'm not gonna. But we have them. Alright, this fight sucks. It's a fucking three on one. Guess we can do this. Oh boy. They are annoying. Oh boy. Alright. Attack, please. There we go. I want orange gel. Blow you away! Destruction! As it will strike! I'm dead. Ow. Ow, ow, ow. Please stop. Six hundred HP left. Here we go. Damn, it's not over yet. Annoying bastards. That's my line. I've been looking all over for you. That one was mine too. <laughs> that was about to get ugly. All right. Whoa, hold on. What are you doing? Yuri. I'm happy to see you're finally seeing the world outside the barrier. So, be a little more happy then. Stop pointing that thing at me. Well, I got a little less happy when I saw this. Hey, it's up to 10,000 gold. Nice. I didn't think when you quit the knights that you'd take up a life of crime. Hey. <laughs> Great picture. A lot of things have happened, Flynn. It's not that simple. Simple or not, a crime is a crime. Good to see you're as stubborn as always. I... Uh-oh. Yuri, I heard something happened. Are you all... Perfect timing. Flynn! Huh? Oh, Flynn, are you all right? Have you been hurt? Uh, I I'm fine. Um, Lady Estelise... Oh, I'm sorry. I was just so happy to see you. I... Please, this way. What? Uh, but Flynn, there's something I need to tell you. I better go find Carol and Rita. Yeah, we better. Eh, let's check the alley again just to make sure. Yeah, okay, good. Yeah, we're, we're hurting. Hopefully we can get some free heals. 
Thought there was something being murdered. Yeah, no. It's always being murdered. Hey, boys. Some guy just dragged Estelle right by us. Are they both inside the inn? Yep. So that other guy was Flynn then. Yeah, well... You might not be able to get a word in edgewise if you went in now. Seemed like they might be in there a while. Want to burn time walking around town a bit? Sure, okay. Hey! Alright, so we have to do some stuff now. Uh... I know where we have to go. Off right. There he is! There he goes! Look at him go! Alright. I don't remember what voice it gave him. Guess you found me. You're pretty good. Teach you to cook, teach you to cook as a reward. Hey. We'll learn how to make sorbet. Thanks. Gotta go till we meet again. He's gone. Just like that. Dust in the wind. Uh, wanted w vicious fugitive at large, dressed in black with front buttons open, male long black hair. If seen, contact the Imperial Knights at once. I'm gonna talk to that cat. Hey, it's a new character. Why me? What the hell is a brat like you doing trying to get in here? Aw, don't throw a hissy fit. Have a bite of this and calm down. Get that out of my face. This isn't the kind of place for kids. Oh. Mmm. That sure is a rough way to treat a child. Who the hell are you? That brat's daddy or something? Seriously, do I look like the parent of a kid this big? Time to try again. Oops! Jesus Christ, you could have gotten fucking impaled! Hey, hey, you really think it's okay to point a weapon at an unarmed child? I'm just teaching the Brad a lesson about the consequences of breaking adult rules. Just cut it out, okay? Yeah. What? What, what are you doing? <coughs> now you've gone and done it. Hold up, you, you've come this far and now you're just gonna run away? You need to be prepared if you're going to grab a beautiful young lass's hand. Prepared? Prepared for what? Sorry. Now ain't the time. Uh, what? Farewell! You brat! Get back here! Damn it. The hell was up with that kid? Hey, buddy. You better get lost, too. You gotta be kidding me. Great. Well, I guess Flynn and Estelle should be done talking by now. Cast off doll. What a waste of talent. What kind of item is that? Is that just a key item? Where would that be? Valuables. Yeah, it is. Alright. Yeah, that character was only in the PlayStation 3 version. I played this back in the 360, so I have no idea about her. I know nothing. I don't know how she fights. I know she joins the party eventually. I don't know how she works, really. Alright, let me... Uh, there we go. Hello. We go inside? Yeah.
a save point. Three hundred gold. You know what? I'm gonna stay a night just for the full heal. Three hundred gold's like nothing. Thank you for the full heal. I needed that. All finished? And are we done whispering secrets? I've heard your story up until this point, Yuri. And also the reason for the bounty on your head. First off, I owe you my thanks for protecting her. Oh, I've been meaning to express my gratitude as well, Yuri. It's nothing. I was already out searching for that Blastia thief. And that's where we have a problem. Hmm? Regardless of the circumstances, the Imperial law cannot allow the obstruction of officers, jailbreaking, and trespassing. I'm sorry. I'm afraid I told him everything. Don't be sorry. I mean, I did all that stuff. Then I assume you are prepared to receive the punishment your actions deserve. Flynn! Do whatever you like, but just listen a minute, will you? So you can tell me how it was all done in order to get back the lower quarters Blastia Corps? That's what you wanted to say, right? Sir Flynn, I have news! What is Rita doing here? I heard you refused an Imperial request for assistance. Do you think it's alright for a mage employed by the Empire to simply abandon her obligations? Who's that? Got me. Huh, whatever. It's not like I care a whit about you, either. I'll make the introductions. This is my second-in-command, Sodia. This is Witcher, a mage who offered his assistance to us at the laboratory in Ospio. This is my- You! Sir, it's the criminal from the Wanted poster! At ease, Sodia. He is a friend of mine. What? But sir, he's a wanted man! I've just heard his story. While he is guilty of minor crimes, the warrant for his arrest contains false accusations. Later, I will return him to the capital and explain the situation. And he will receive his due punishment. My... my mistake, sir. Witcher, let's have your report. So we're done here, right? I believe the ongoing rain and wind are being caused by a Blastia. The weather in this season is unpredictable, but this does not explain why it worsens whenever boats leave port. We also have testimony that something like a Blastia was carried into Magistrate Rago's residence. I've never heard anything about a Blastia that controlled the weather. Nothing like that has ever been excavated. Wait. The Aqua Blastia, the ruins... It couldn't be. So his lordship, the Magistrate, is using a Blastia to control the weather. It appears that way, though we can't yet say for certain. The harbor has been closed due to weather. Any ship that leaves is fired on for disobeying the ordinance. So much for crossing over to Torum. Those aren't the only rumors surrounding the Magistrate. He's released a monster known as Ribgaro into the wild, and amuses himself by forcing those who can't pay their taxes to hunt it. He claims he'll pardon their taxes if they can manage to capture the beast. How cruel! That injured couple we met near the entrance must be two of his victims. And their child. What? What happened to their child? Forget about it. Well, it's been a hell of a day for us and we're tired. Let's just stay at this inn for the night. Also, we can't forget about a certain missing person. Missing person? Ah, yes. All right. Hello. They, they have to pay again. I'm paying again. Six hundred gold. I've done it. I did it. I paid six hundred gold. Might as well make sure everyone's fully healed. I thought I still joined me. Guess not. So what's the plan? I'm gonna go see Magistrate Rago. What? We'll get turned away at the gate if we try to go there. Even a noble woman like you would have no chance of getting in. Yeah, but with the harbor barricaded, we can't cross over to Torum Harbor. 
And that thief Tadeki, along with that one-eyed giant, are both on the other side of the water. Let's stop blabbing about it and just go, why don't we? If you won't listen to what we have to say, we can think of another plan. All right. Let's head to Rago's palace then. Not yet. Because I believe I can do a really annoying side quest now. Yes, I can. All right. No matter how you slice it, Flynn is Flynn. He's even more stubborn than before. <laughs> you think so too, Repeat? <laughs> well, at least he seemed to be doing all right. Yep. Well, let's go to the trader and actually see what he has now that we have a full party. First of all, magic lenses. Uh, uh, uh. Need some orange gels. Okay, uh, so I already have that. Morning Star, that's a new weapon. It's got recovery and vitality. Very nice. Buy that. Heavy Maul, completely new weapon. A mighty Charge. Oh, he's got Charge Attack and then Strength 2. Nice, we'll buy that. Oh, we have one of those. We have one of those. We have an upgraded chain already. Uh, those won't add too much defense. Uh, I should buy one of these just for Carol, because he needs. Use the armor. And I'll buy that. Alright. Uh, what do I need for the recipe uh, that I have set up? Rice, dried seaweed, salmon. Rice. Red seaweed. Salmon. There we go. Alright, now for a really annoying minigame. Oh yeah. Casually your grabber. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I didn't check the synthesis, did I? What do you have? I already have a rapier. Barracks plus one is equipped. Scarf plus one. That's new. Get that. Game plus one we have. Oka we have. Oka plus one we have. Nothing new there. And Drake Eye. Where did I get that? Amanda Gore in the Koi Woods. Share. Got the heavy maul. Wait, that was that was quite a big increase in damage on that. That's very good. And a very good new armor for you. Alright. Nice. Alright, time for a shitty minigame. Oh, excuse me, young lady. Can you spare a minute or two? Oh, you mean me? Yes, yes indeed. You think you might want to play a little stone-taking game with me? Make it interesting, I'll give you a nice present if you can beat me. What do you say? Hmm, well, why not? But are you sure I'm pretty good at that kind of game? Oh, excellent. I've been looking for an opponent to give me a challenge. They call me the master. I won't go down without a fight. Really have to be time to sitting and playing games? Play a game! Oh, well, shall we begin? A uh, high or low? Let's go high or low. Uh, hi. 
I have to win three times in a row. Yay. Hello. Hey, I'm gonna go for high now. I hope I win. Please. Please be high. Please be a high roll. Oh, that's not high, I don't think. Fuck. Frankly, after all that big talk, I was expecting a more impressive showing. What? No, you got it all wrong. Just feeling a little under the weather is all. Oh, feel free to come back for a rematch when you're feeling better. Yeah, right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Skip event. Play the higher low. Hi. I'm gonna go for second high. I'm feeling lucky. It's 50-50 chance. Hey! Nah, it's gotta be low now, right? It's gotta be low now, right? It's gonna be high. It's it's high. It's low! Never mind, I won! That was quick! <laughs> yeah, gel set! Apple gel, orange gel, lottery gel. Too bad you didn't do all that well the first time you tried. Shut up. Now winning against me in two tries is still quite impressive. Feet for young girl. See? Now, for your prize, a delicious kiss from yours truly. <laughs> I fooled you. Now I'm going to give you the title of new master. As the news of my defeat travels, new challenges will appear, hoping to steal your glory. Be strong and don't lose, Rita. That is the new stone taking master, Rita. We continue next time, and a new assassin lurks. We continued? It's not likely. Oh! -ho -ho. Well, if you ever feel like you've... Here, you're welcome to join me in my hobbies. Yay. A city where the magistrate can do whatever he wants really leaves a bad taste in your mouth. Looks like there's bound to be a few power mad Imperials no matter where you go. What we saw on the way into town here, and that happened all the time back in the lower quarter. I'm glad I live outside the Empire. I don't think I could stand this very long. Why would the Magistrate do these things? Hey, we don't need to let the bad vibes in this city rub off on us. Exactly. All right. All right, uh... Oh yeah, we can keep playing with it if we want, but no need to. Rita got a title from that, which is a Dice Master. Doesn't do anything, but we have it. Great, uh... Yeah. Here's what I'm gonna do. I want to take a shower, and I also want to to shave. So I'm gonna end the stream for a bit. Gonna go shower, do a bit of a shave, stuff like that. Then I'll probably be back in the stream some more. So I'm gonna do that. So thank you for joining me. I will be back in 30 to 40 minutes.